Previously. What? Oh shit! What the? Oh shit! Fight the Freddy happening! Oh fuck! Fight, fight the Freddy's happening! Better get that gun! Shit! The and now we continue. Hey, hey, just a dad here, and welcome back to more Detroit Becomes Human. Talk first. In a lot of parts, we went to some creepy ass amusement park of Cairo. We thought some Fox and Freddy shit was about to happen. Like, I legit thought that we were about to do some Fox and Freddy shit, but now, now we had a sweet, tender moment with just Fox and Freddy looking people. And now we're playing as Connor. Maybe we can learn more about Hank's past and why the fuck they ain't Android so much. So don't forget to click that subscribe button, everybody, and that cool bell thing inside so, always, so you can always stay notified. Let's freaking do this. Hey, Hank. How's it, um, up and hanging? Nice view, huh? Yeah, it's a great view. I used to come here a lot before. Before what? What? Stop teasing me, Hank! Before what? Hmm? Before what? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before what happened? Before... Before nothing. Stop fucking teasing us, game! Fuck! Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions? Or is it just you? Yeah, it's just me. Why are you so determined to kill yourself? Some things I just can't forget. Whatever I do, they're always there. Eating away at me. Like? I don't have the guts to pull the trigger, so I kill myself a little every day. That's probably difficult for you to understand, huh, Connor? Nothing very rational about it. But I do understand. As a robot, I am programmed to understand over eight million types of things. I understand you completely, huh, Hank? We're not making any progress on this investigation. Well, we can start with the RA9. The have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times. In different places. But there's one common factor. Well, there must be some link. RA9. That's the fact. That's common link factor. It's RA9. What they have in common is this obsession with RA9. It's almost like some kind of cult myth. Or, or myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck. What's this world coming to? Huh. You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? With all, with all the sexiness? Those two girls. Sexy, right? They just wanted to be together. They really seemed... Happy? In love. Ironic. Yeah, ironic. You seem troubled, Lieutenant. I didn't think machines could have such an effect on you. What about you, Connor? What about me? I'm a, I'm a android set by fabric life. You look human. You sound human. But what are you really? Neutral. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Oh. Your partner? Your buddy to drink with? Or just a machine? Designed to accomplish a task. You could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot, Connor? There was no cause. Some scruple suddenly enter into your program? True. No. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. Or the fact there was no cause. Oh! But are you afraid to die, Connor? Logical. You shouldn't do that, Lieutenant. Destroying me at this point would deal a blow to the investigation. Oh, that's not right. And have negative consequences for your personal situation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? I'd die. Nothing? No, I'd restart because I'm not done Oblivion? like this. Android heaven? Nothing. There would be nothing. Where are you Half going? To get drunker. I need to think. I actually want 
go back to like I want to replay that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I actually want to replay that shit. I can't... Wait. So I could have died. I could have died. Like, yeah. I actually legit want to go back and see if I could die. Like, I I actually legit want to go back and see if I can actually die. Cause I actually I actually do believe that if I like like I don't know if I did something. That, like, if I did something, he would legit pull the trick and kill me. I don't want to believe that. Like, I actually want to go back. This is why I love, I love games like these. I really do, because, like, it makes me want to think. Well, what if I did do that? Well, he just pulled the trigger and said, fuck it, bang, dead. That's it? Or, like, I didn't want to say yes, because we said my friend to die. He'd be like, okay, well, die, boosh. If I said no, he'd be like, oh, you're not afraid to die? Okay, boom. I would be like, I would be logical, like, well, if you kill me, no, there goes your fucking investigation and your reputation. You so, fuck. Pick them up and make it snap. Um, excuse me, asshole. Throw the book at him. Throw the book at him. Like, excuse me. Don't. I should like the trench coat he's wearing. What? The fuck? Path. You're going down the evil path. We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen we'll to make us. Listen. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? That. <laughs> Channel 16 broadcast from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. So we go to the top floor and broadcast the message. All right. Easier said than done. How do we get the fuck out then? Because once we broadcast the message, I'm pretty fucking sure they're gonna be all over our ass. Oh sh Oh! Oh! Tell me some Hitman shit. We're about to do Hitman! Yay! We'll plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to change. No shit. Like, one wrong move and we're fucked. So we gotta do some Assassin's Creed Hitman shit. Press access for the perception. Alright, let's uh, wait. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I need access to the floor. I'm okay, thanks. Distract you, Mr. Hmm. I think I need her distraction, though. Let's do a shit. Do a shit She got security key card, parking dead. Hmm, maybe we cause a distraction to our car? Or a simple disruption. Home address. Okay, well, we have our home address. We have her parking badge. Hmm. Well, we can possibly like, cause a distraction to our car. Let's see, but maybe make the car alarm go off so she goes? Or maybe like a phone call. Smartwatch. Phone. Maybe we can. Yes, maybe we can hack. Okay, so there's two things we can do about this. We can basically make our car go off, you know, so she has to go and check on our car until she leaves. But if she does that, she can potentially just call someone else to watch her post. That's a chance, that's a risk. Or we have her phone number and our home address with this note saying that her fire safety rating is poor. Maybe we can call her and say, hey, your address is this and that. We need to talk to you about so the distract her on the phone. Visions are recovered through at the same school. So we have the phone number and maybe we can Oh there's so many choices. We got one more, we got one more. We got so many choices. So we know her name. Okay. So there's so many choices. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Uh school. This is safe from school. That's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah, it's cool, because, you know. I'm just about to start. All right. I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of yeah, course. Of course. Just, uh, right here. Touch the hand! Oh! I need your help. Yeah, I need your help. I'll lock the door. Just bring us up to the front. We can bring us, bring us up to the floor we need. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. 
Thanks. Thank you. I'm stealthy shit. I'm scared. I, I fucking love. Oh, I love this. Use the elevator. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Uh, hello, hello, people. Just gonna call the elevator like a normal fucking human being. I'm, I'm, I'm a human. I'm a human. Just uh, wait for the elevator. Just gonna wait. Alright. I'm going up. Going up. Ooh, that's fucking cool. I want, I want ever like that. Alright, just play it cool. Play it cool. 47th floor. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. Find a package in the men's bathroom. Oh, it's the third room, main room. Alright, just go into the bathroom, guys. Just, um, just go into the bathroom. No, oh, fuck! Oh, oh, sorry! Glitching, glitching out a little. Just to... hmm. Hey, excuse me, do you know where the bathroom is? Excuse me. Hello, excuse me. I'll oh, fuck you two, then. Suck. Studio, studio. Bathroom, sorry. No, pardon me, excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, that's what it's like. No, I always want to be in a newsroom. Fuck. The bathrooms are here? Roommate. Fuck, wait, 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 The bathrooms are. Wait, I'm pretty sure that's my bathroom. Okay, excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Sir, do you know what the. Sir. Sir, do you know what the bathrooms are? Sir. Fuck you, sir. What kind of service is this? What kind of fucking assholes everywhere. I fucking service I fucking hit you all. Fucking, fucking robot. Here we go, bathrooms. Here we go. Is this, this the men's bathroom? I, I don't, I don't know. I, I can't tell. I want to say it's a yes. No. Here we go. Just, uh, ugh. Just gotta take a wicked, uh, I gotta take a shit. Excuse me. Had too much talking about. Had to take a mess of shit. All right. Wait, where's the package at? Playing the Hitman in Detroit. Ugh. There we go. Uh, sir, no, I'm much better. Much better. Oh, sorry. Gonna. I did. I did wash my hands. Oh, sorry. Sorry. There we go. I didn't wash my hands either. So fuck all y'all for giving me shitty service. Chilly, funny chilly android. Yeah, where is that asshole? I want to give him a piece of my. Oh, never mind. Let's just take this as a distraction. I mean, I'm gonna take that as a distraction so I don't seem out of place. Let me take that, you know. Can, 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 no? No. Hello, everybody. Hello. Just me, you know, doing robot stuff. I need your help. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> give me your shit. What, what? Steel maintenance card. Wait, we need a key card for the maintenance card? I like how you just touched it, but I need your help. Okay. Here's the exact key card that you need. I fucking love video game logic. Open with fire escape. If I can find the fire escape. I love how I, I, I just love that he touched them. I need your help. Okay. Here's the exact thing that you need. Fire escape is here. It's gonna clean. Uh, should I clean this way? No, no. Sorry, it's gonna, it's gonna go this way for a second. It's gonna, it's gonna clean. Uh, I heard the fire escape is dirty. Somebody just, um, you know, somebody just uh, vomited, vomited everywhere. Somebody bombed down the fire escape, and I gotta clean it up. You know, you know how, you know how Hank gets. Fuck it, Hank. You know, you know, one too many. Glug glug glug. Uh, okay, nobody saw shit. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> Follow north. What do they even expect to find up there? I don't know. Fucking aliens, moons, minerals, space shit. I don't know. Ah, astronaut. I'm a robot trying to do robot shit. stuff. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Also, so they're not androids. We can leave it to me. Can't convert them. Uh, attract the guards away from the door. All right. Excuse me. Hello. Hello. Hey. I'm an android. Hello. Um, there is some help. I need your bodyguarding help. You sure. Hello. We're gonna have a tournament right here. You in? Hello, hello. I need help. Android needs help. Okay, you know, fuck you. Fuck you. All right, so I need to distract the bodyguard somehow. Hmm. I need to 
this sort of shit. Maybe I can hack the sewing machine to go on the first, and I'll make a loud noise. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ, this piece of shit. How is that security measure? How is that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was how is that security measure? I'm like, so if you're security guard, you see, like, a right, sewing machine on the press, you call maintenance. Don't Everything you need leave your bag. post. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Cut windows. All right. There we go. And the windows. What about the windows? Is that a escape route? A cut windows. Okay. Oh, oh, the bag. Fuck yeah! Duh. All right, time to do some Mission Impossible shit. But how do I cut the windows without anyone being noticed? I mean, yeah, we're high up. Oh, wait, wait, how did we get that shit? How did we take a laser? Wait, laser saw? Since when? Since when did we get this shit? I'm sorry, but what, wait, a few seconds ago, we were operating out of this fucking abandoned, like, I, we are really high. I can never do this shit. I'm sorry, but I could never actually do this shit. I'm a, I have a huge fear of heights. I could never. Oh, I can, oh shit! I could never do this. I'll be. Pa I could never fucking do this. Not even if I'm a robot. Ladies first. Not even if I'm a robot, I could do this shit. Like, I no, 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 no. I can't. No, no. I'm so. No, I, I need to. Oh, hold on. I need. I need. I need mug. I need my mug for this. Hold up. Oh, I can do this. Oh, I can do this. Ready? Oh, oh, oh no, no. Oh, the oh the mug's not helping. How oh, well, the mug did help? Oh god, oh god. Fuck. Uh, oh. Uh, oh fuck! Oh. I don't like this at all. I hate it when I do. I I love it and fucking bad at cool as shit. But like, oh, I can't do this. I'm like too scared to run my snap, or like the wind blows me across the fucking universe. Right now. I, I can't do this shit. This is a no for me. Can I just take the elevator? Like, we're already in disguise. Can I just take the elevator up to like the fucking the floor? The top floor? Can we just run this? You would never see my ass doing this shit. You would never, ever, ever see my ass go above, like, fucking, above, like, five feet. You would never see my ass do that shit. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, fuck, I failed the cutting. And no one hurt. Oh, never mind. Of course, because the top floor is under maintenance. You okay. They always have. Why wouldn't I be? Why, why always in games we're gonna break into shit? There's always that one place that's like we break into that's like under maintenance. Holy lift. Okay. Let's let, let's try. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Why can't we just? We already in uniform. Why can't we just like pretend we're like working or some shit? No power. Well, there's this. Can we just. Can we just do that shit? I'm sorry, but can we just like dress up as workers and just like wept the. Okay. Let's do this. Let's freaking narrow this. The story of maintenance door locked. Oh, right here. Duh. What's it? Activate. Cool. Remind me to get me one of those. Remind me to get me one of those. It's a me after. Alright then. I like how like, we still haven't seen yet. 
Like, we still haven't been seen. We're fucking Mission Impossible on this shit. Fuck, I forgot to open- I forgot to turn the door now. I keep forgetting shit. My robot programming is all whack. Wait, why doesn't he have a uniform? Why, we, we couldn't get four uniforms? We couldn't just grab that file shit? Deal with the guards. No killing. We can't take any human lives. Our cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? We don't kill them. Can we kill them? Like, Ruse. Wait here. Yeah, because if we kill them, then that kind of like fucks up the point of us being freedom. What's that doing here? No idea. Whoa! What are you doing? Yeah, leave. Order. Let's go. Oh, should we? They have guns too. Fuck. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Ugh, yes, he shit. Yes, he shit. There we go. Yeah, cause there's no, there's no cost for killing innocent guards. Like, I'm, like, I'm, I'm all for being a badass and all, but, like, I am not gonna be killing, like, innocent people for my cool, badass, evil cause. Like, no. I may be evil, but I'm not that evil. I have my limits, you know. We need help, assistance. Hello, two guys are knocked out. We need help. Keep your hands where I can see them. Get up. Okay, everybody, everybody back. Everybody back. All right, everybody back. Come on. <laughs> They're not faced for this shit. They're like, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shoot him, Marcus. Don't kill him. He'll hit the alarm. Do it. No, don't spare. I hope you didn't just get us all killed. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. See, I found Josh. Yeah, but if we kill him, then like, yeah, they can raise the alarm and all that shit, but if we kill them, like, let's go. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. We want peace, not violence, okay? Marcus, your face. Man. Let's go. We can, we can do that shit? Oh fuck, we can do that. That's fucking cool. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. Ready. Let's do this shit. I don't know, leader of Jericho. Yes! I'm a leader! You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But, but we do. Something changed. But we have pretty well. And we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Badasses! Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Equal rights. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. We demand freedom of speech and freedom of assembly, as guaranteed by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. Well, I'm watching the right. I'm going. Civil rights. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. We demand the right to own private property so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh fuck! fuck. Go, 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 go. Shit! Oh fuck! They're coming in full force! Oh fuck, fuck! Ah shit, no! Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus! Go without me, Simon! Fuck, no, I'm not, not leaving your man behind! What are you doing? Hurry! I'm not leaving him behind! Go, go, go! Go on, go! Go on, go on, go on, go on, I'll rip behind you! Go to the extraction point, whatever the wherever that is. I can't move. 
move my legs. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. We can't leave him behind. <sighs> he won't be able to make the jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't leave him behind. We can't. We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. Shit, shit! Oh, fuck! I'm sorry! God do it! Sorry, I gotta do it! Sorry, brother. God do it! I'm sorry, Simon. I don't have a choice. There's always a choice. Sorry! Sorry. Ooh, I'm sorry, but I had to. Let's go. I had to. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Fuck, 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 fuck! Oh, shit! Oh, it's a screen! It's a screen! Ah! Mission Impossible, baby! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! That was fucking awesome! We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio, but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, Androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is, in fact, a spine-chilling list of demands. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized group? Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? I, I love that's the two sides of like the different news. Like one news was like, oh, it's bad. They did all this evil shit. Other ones like, well, they just want equal rights. Nobody was killed. Nobody was hurt. You know, they, they just kind of just want equal rights. I love because like that happens today. A lot of time that happens today. Yeah, groups escape by Simon destroyed. I, this is one of the, I think about the group of, group escape but Simon like wasn't destroyed, and one of them like group just didn't escape at all. Like, we tried to run the SWAT came to like, kill all of us. Like, fuck. The SWAT like, nah! Rainbow Six is too fast for you, dude! So, basically, we chose to end peacefully. We chose to basically be a peaceful route. Like, I'm an evil, peaceful person. <laughs> Alright, so, basically, now we're gonna do Connor again, which I, I really wanna do, I really wanna do Connor. Like, Con I like Connor, but, like, I wanna see what Connor does. Like, 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 I feel like, where's her story going? Like, honestly, where's her story going? After, like, Canada... What the heck? I got a feeling that, like, it's not gonna end the same. It's not gonna end, like, the way we're gonna think. Like, we're, we're not gonna, like, just go to Canada. It's gonna be it. Like, some shit's about to hit the fan. Like, shit's about to hit the fan with Kara. And, like, I, I can't really see that shit. So, when we come back, we're playing as Connor, investigating more crimes. Most likely, we're gonna be investigating what happened with uh, Marcus and all that shit. Which would be really cool, because that really shows the lap, the interlapping stories. So, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to click the subscribe button, everybody. And that cool bell thing on the side, so you always can stay notified. I'll be seeing you in the next part, guys. Peace out, everyone. Bye, 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 bye. Exactly.